六六六。你看你们的羊肉串儿烤的，羊肉串儿。<笑>兄弟们，我们是羊肉羊肉串儿，羊肉串啊，起码味儿好。Hi, I'm Jeremy Goldcorn, standing in front of a Xinjiang restaurant on、uh, the western part of Ghost Street in Beijing. We've just been talking to、uh, a guy from Xinjiang whose family owns this restaurant. Ah, you, you, 叫什么名字呀？我叫 Imran. Imran. Yeah. Imran. Yeah, Imran. And his name is Imran. This yang rou, where did you buy it? Yang rou is we from Xinjiang buy it. From Xinjiang buy it. Ah, yes. Went to Beijing. Went to Beijing. In there is no yang rou place. This yang rou place. Ah. Xinjiang is China's far western province. Its native people are mostly from the Uyghur ethnic group. Their language is related to Turkish, and their food seems Middle Eastern rather than Chinese. Many Uyghurs come to Beijing to find their fortunes, often in the restaurant business. Xinjiang the word, this Xinjiang the rule, this Beijing the rule, not different. We have a lot of restaurants, a lot of money, and we can divide it up. Ah, other restaurants. Ah, yes. How long have you been in Beijing? I've been in Beijing for ten years. Ten years? Ah, ten years. Is it your restaurant? Yes, it's our restaurant. Yes, it's our restaurant. Yes, it's our restaurant. Yes, it's our restaurant. 一千嘛，刚羊肉串卖嘛，一千多，大概就是一千五。一千五羊肉串、啊、一天。啊，就是刚羊肉串，我们卖柚子、板筋、乳筋，其他的还有。嗯。其他的全部加上一天嘛，两千块钱就是，大概两千块钱，刚买羊肉串。两千块钱。一天。对，一天。生意好啊。生意可以啊。嗯。馕是你们自己做的吗？啊，我们自己做的馕。Many Uyghurs also sell lamb kebabs from street stalls, which are a fixture of Beijing nightlife. Whether outside trendy clubs or in working-class neighborhoods, where they play the function of a neighborhood pub in the summer. This is matang, a Uyghur sticky sweet made from raisins, nuts, and caramelized sugar. Matang vendors, often operating from small tricycles, are a common sight in the capital. <laughs> <coughs> 哎呦，太大了！毛包的吗？那是布尔。三斤，三斤。我一会儿就忙，我一会儿就都得干，忙我干事情。我现在在吃，可好？我一会儿就那，你们看那忙那个嘛，那吃个嘛子嘛，二娃子嘛，还在那个打卡看那个，我现在打卡都看到。土耳其的话能听得懂吗？土耳其的话，有些话可以听懂，有些话听不懂。他们说慢一点嘛，可以听懂；说快一点嘛，我们听不懂。我们到土耳其去过，你去过土耳其？干嘛去土耳其？土耳其我们看亲戚去，我们有一个亲戚土耳其呢。我们是伊斯兰教，我们是维吾尔族，就是维族，就是维吾尔族，伊斯兰教。So it's not easy for Uyghurs to make it in Beijing. Uh, there are a lot of obstacles uh, towards their success, including suspicion from the locals and difficulty sometimes with permits. But there are many successful Uyghur entrepreneurs, and we've just been speaking to one of them. This is Jeremy Goldcorn reporting to you from a spring day on Ghost Street in Beijing for Dangwei TV. The Yang Chuan Li is just a cover.